Okay. All right. I had to replay this part because uh, I didn't realize you that you couldn't save. Right? Yes. Just Let's get the money like, and the go. Of mission. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our Just orders. surrender. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five. opening this door. What are we going to do? Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them okay. up a little. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith <laughs> some dynamite. You two boys go blow mm -hmm. that door open. Now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a Seems step Seems good back. enough. Here we go. Now okay. light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. I want this hat. All right, come on. There's one going out here. I want the hat. We don't want to kill you. My, oh my. We just want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> Move. <laughs> Give me that. No, I can't get it. Ah, dang it. All right, whatever. Look at this place. It's like wow. a palace. Now I've seen everything. Oh, you this would be pretty safe. cool to oh, yes. experience be easy if as they had cake. like old timey trains still. You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Hey, now, this see if we can get this. this. Oh, are these the bonds? Okay. Think I got him. Is that all we need? Oh, okay, that's all we need. Wait, I want other stuff. I want a cigar. And need a pocket watch. Oh, I can't carry any. Okay. Dang it, there was a... Alright, whatever. <laughs> what did you find? These... Bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here. Why? Why the did train. they give me? Just make sure they don't send no folk after like us. This. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. I can't kill them. Or can't? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. Get on I'm not the gonna kill them. Any bright ideas, I kill all three. Go. So Come on. Behave. Did you hear that? It was an elk Go. or something. It was so beautiful. Go. Said quick. If I hear so much as a footstep from yes. this car, you'll end up like all your friends out here. Wait. I just want to see. Okay, perfect. Dear Mr. Cornwall, we are yet to receive payment of 2000 for the initial phase. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. What's this? Okay, I can do it. 
So we have to go start the train. Where's it going? Are we just sending it away? I guess so. Okay. See you later, fellas. Oh, for Lord's sake, put that book away and go help. So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind mm. us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country Hopeful a little. Thinking. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, Sounds let's good. go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Oh, wait. <laughs> I remember this part. So the first time I ever played this through... Oh, this is really beautiful. This one. There's another video on my channel. It's a short video. Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've mm -hmm. had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Everything look all right. Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. <laughs> you need help? Uh. I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on. Oh, you God. still strong enough to hold up a wheel? Up. Shut up. I'm just saying. Jeez. I'll say less. Pick the wheel up. <laughs> Nearly there. there. That it? See? There. You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. That's scary. Poor bastards. 
We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Yeah. So, yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them it was, every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasant? Yeah. We don't. In spite of that, just talk. No, we do not. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Huh? Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget. This here's a con man, Charles. Born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's yeah. talking about. He's dumb. So, what happened to your trap? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. Marston? John Marston? We still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. Ooh, I've been fine. through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. The Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And so this we place really don't for like gold. Pinkertons. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? It's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. Always yep. has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Thank you. Okay, thank you. That's nice of him. A variety of plants can be picked and found throughout the world. You can learn about their properties. Compendium? How do you 
pronounce that word. <laughs> there you are, brother. Head in there. Follow the track for a bit. Nice. <laughs> hey, slow up. I'll jump on. What if I just kept from the right? Okay, let's go. I wonder what he would have said. Hey, wait up. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Let's just Excellent. drive right over this giant bush. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Kind of hidden away. How did they set all this up already? Here we Weren't are, we only like 10 or 15 home, minutes home. late? All right. You were wrong, Jose. This place is we perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were on to something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe mm. before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a long way from our dream of virgin land in the west. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Yeah, head out I around them, both be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. One day at a time. Would you just look around you? One day at a time, Jose. This world has its consolation. Rush everything. <laughs> Gentlemen. I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. Okay. Hi. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find... Why not you, Mr. Pearson? ...gets its slice. Now you be sensible out there. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't money. remind me. Well, we can always That's make right. more money. We're gonna That's have exactly to. right. Things Miss come Betsy, and go. I've seen shit with more that common sense okay. than you. Do it properly. Alright, I think that's a good place to stop it. Ooh. Chapter 2, what did it say? Horseshoe Overlook? A couple of weeks later. Yeah, I'm going to stop it there for now. And wait. If I can't... Here, let's see if I can save first. Because I, I don't want to stop playing. Got off play a the mountain. Longer. Rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. 
Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more, and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier, in spite of black water and that whole mess. Arthur? Jose? <laughs> Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little <laughs> smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. Sounds good. Okay, that's where I'll stop it. And I don't like saying bye, so I'll see you tomorrow.